On my ever ongoing quest to find the most bokeh and sharpness available for Polaroid 600 and SX70 films, I have come across this gem. What you're looking at here is an integral Polaroid film back for the Mamiya Universal Press, custom made by Lo-Fi and DIY. I came across this back while searching for accessories for my newly acquired Mamiya Universal Press camera, which replaced my Polaroid 600 SE, and now I can finally say that it takes better Polaroids too. This back has the added functionality of also shooting iTight film, since it has its own power source with the four AA's in the battery compartment. There are some caveats, however, and we'll get into that in this video. The back is made from a disassembled Polaroid iType camera and custom 3D printed materials. The creator states that he used 50% fill instead of 20% to make sure that it's built to last, and I can attest to that. The 3D printed portions felt strong and well constructed. The only issue I had with the build quality was that the camera he sacrificed to make the back had a bit of a floppy mouth where you insert the film. It never seemed to close all the way, but this didn't seem to affect picture taking or ejecting the film. My biggest concern with any sort of custom back is focal plane issues. The creator states that it's placed in the perfect position to allow you to focus with your camera's own rangefinder so you don't have to guess your focus. I believe that it gets close, but it's not quite there. I'm not sure if this is my model particularly or some kind of design flaw, but I noticed that after focusing on something, I'd have to push the camera forward an inch or two for it to actually be in focus. For example, when I focused on something 5 feet away, the focal point would actually be more like 4 or 4.5 four feet away. Unfortunately, I only noticed this about halfway into the shoot, so some of my images suffered from a slight lack of focus. It's a little bit annoying, but now I have my workaround so I can live with it. I'd say that would be the one advantage of the CB70 back as opposed to one of these custom backs. Normal people don't usually have access to the machines needed to create the perfect tolerances that factories can provide. But I am just happy to have the opportunity to shoot Polaroids on my Mamiya Universal. I'd say that if you're looking for something truly unique and are a lover of all things Polaroid and you're seeking a way to create images that you couldn't physically make on another system, then this is definitely worth it. It has a few flaws, but maybe there's a chance that these could be ironed out over time. At a price point of about $300, it certainly undercuts the insane prices that the CB70 back is going for nowadays. Also, this guy has a really cool website for Polaroid nerds like you and me. I highly recommend checking it out. I'll put a link in the description below. Thanks for watching.